Welcome to our video on the norovirus by GMIT medical science students Ashling Emer, Kate and Grace. The norovirus is an RNA non-enveloped virus. It is a small rounded virus. The norovirus belongs to a group of viruses known as Khaleesi viruses. This is Norman the norovirus. The norovirus causes a gastrointestinal infection known as the winter vomiting bug. It is a notifiable infection which usually lasts one to three days. People usually show symptoms 24 to 48 hours after being infected. The most common symptoms of the norovirus infection include a raised temperature, headaches, stomach cramps, aching limbs, forceful vomiting and watery diarrhea. This virus can affect people of all ages and genders. It causes the most severe infections in young children, the elderly and immunocompromised people. The norovirus primarily gains entry into the body through the mouth. This can occur when you eat or drink foods that are contaminated with the virus have contact with somebody who has the virus or touch a surface contaminated with the virus. Most of the norovirus outbreaks occur in the food service industry like restaurants. Infected food workers are frequently the source of the outbreaks, often by touching ready to eat foods such as raw fruit, fruit and vegetables with their bare hands before serving them. However, any food served raw or handled after being cooked can be contaminated with the virus. Norovirus can also spread quickly in places like creches, nursing homes and schools. In Ireland the norovirus is prevalent in winter months. In 2006 there was a high occurrence of the infection. In that year alone 59% of gastrointestinal infections were due to the norovirus. The HSEE reported the highest number of infections that year, 83 cases. The virus is prevalent all over Ireland, but the Midlands region has the highest rate to date. It is usually diagnosed by taking a stool or vomit sample from a patient who displayed symptoms for 48 to 72 hours. The sample can then be tested using a real-time reverse transcriptase polymerase chain reaction this detects the RNA sequence in the pathogen. Enzyme immunoassays can be used in the identification of a norovirus outbreak, but it is not recommended for individual cases. The electron microscope can also be used to identify it, but again, molecular methods are favourable. There is no treatment that can be given that is specific to the norovirus. There is usually no need to see a doctor as it will run its course. It is important to keep hydrated as due to the vomiting and diarrhea, dehydration may occur, especially in infants, the elderly and people with an underlying health condition. And this dehydration may lead to the requirement for medical attention. Usually the symptoms will clear up after one to three days. Norovirus infection is highly contagious and anyone can be infected more than once. To help prevent its spread, avoid sharing towels with others, avoid contaminated food and water including food that may have been prepared by somebody who was sick. Wash your hands thoroughly, especially after using the toilet or changing a diaper. We'll add a link to a useful hand washing video we made earlier. Thank you for watching our video on Norman the Norovirus and be sure to subscribe for more informative videos. These are our references.